Fellas, what's up? It's Ajax here with a really quick bench update. Um, working on the NYS Modeling Pro Street build, and this update should be so quick, in fact, that I didn't bother uh, setting up the tripod. Just wanted to walk you through what I've been working on over the course of this weekend. Uh, as you can see here, the, um, the chassis is uh, good and weathered up, and I'm probably on my second to last pass on the... Uh, on the weathering here um going to add let's see get a pointer here going to add one uh, uh one more layer of grime in here um really darken up these uh these tubs and uh in this area back here um as well as touching in and uh adding some uh some more some more debris or not debris but uh, rather um tire dust back here uh so once i get that all squared away I'll uh, hit it with a final shot of uh, a flat coat to um, hold all that together, and that will be done uh, over here. We've got the engine and uh, some of the engine components. Um, you can see there that I've done a, uh, a bit of uh, detail work, and the engine is all the way together. Um, I have a uh, have a, uh, a rod here for the uh, uh, the water hose and. Um, yeah, as you can see here, I've also got um, some fuel lines that may very well be making their way onto this uh, this engine as well. Um, got those chromed out headers or valve covers there, rather. Um, really thinking about throwing those in the purple pond if my uh, my replacement he headers aren't going to work. Uh, the dashboard detail has been taken care of. Uh, you can see there the uh, the white is from the micro crystal clear that's been put in place. Uh, I've got the decals on the seats. Those are, uh, those are currently drying um, over here. Uh, I've got the interior and the interior is essentially, essentially finished. Um, I've highlighted all the areas that need to be highlighted. That roll cage is glued in place as are the, uh, the door slots, the fire extinguisher, the shift knob, etc. cetera. Um, all this stuff will, uh, will be put together. And then the, um, this, uh, this rear here will be polished. Um, speaking of polishing, I've got the uh, final bit of clear on the body, and it will need to be uh, uh, to be wet sanded down and then polished so that the uh, the little uh, the little bit of reflection that you're seeing there in the uh, in the trunk and the roof has a, uh, a mirror like finish to it. Um, same thing with the uh, the hood and the steering wheel there. Um, the hood will get a fair bit of polish. And the last bit of stuff here is my chrome. Um, the chrome has actually been hit with a uh, uh, the smoke window tint. I'm not sure if you can readily tell the difference. So we will move in here on these, these rims and then we'll place the regular chrome right next to it. And you can see, yeah, there is a bit of... Uh, even though it's not focusing, you still get the idea. The kick chrome is a fair bit lighter than this chrome here. Um, happy with that look. As soon as it dries and cures, I will uh, I'll uh, add the detailing to it, and we'll uh, we'll hit final assembly. So that's the uh, that's the long and the short of it here for the. Uh, the NYS Modeling Pro Street build. Uh, thank you, Dylan, for hosting. And thank you, all of my subscribers who have been following along for following along. And um, I will... Oh, wait, one thing. The uh, suspension, the front and rear, are both built up and, uh, and detailed. Um, I, of course, will be going in and uh, adding a bit more weathering to the, uh, the rear end and the wheelie bar and whatnot as soon as I have the uh, the opportunity but um, yeah that is the long and short of what I have here and so rather than dragging the video out I will wish you guys a pleasant rest of the evening take care